hey guys welcome back to my channel for today's tutorial um i was supposed to upload a valentine's day look but i'm just gonna scratch that whole idea out and bring you guys this natural looking eyebrow tutorial um i already do i got asked quite a lot actually on snapchat because i've been doing this one on snapchat quite often i get asked like how i do the steps and i do explain it in snapchat i also explained it um in a video post on instagram but i just wanted to make a video to kind of bring it in a little bit more and get a little bit more more detailed with the steps because i know it can get a little bit confusing when you're writing it out and you know just not seeing the steps how they actually are and how it looks and you know just all that stuff so i decided to make a video um i hope you guys enjoy it so let's just get right into it so I zoomed you guys up a whole lot more so we could kind of see the process a little bit more. This is what my eyebrow looks without any product on. As you can see, I barely have any hairs that complete um, the tail part. I do have some now just because I did let them grow out in the front. They are a little bit more sparse and there are some hairs missing. And then this is what the eyebrow looks like after. As you can tell, it looks really full and they just look different compared like side by side. So we're going to go from this to this in a second. The first thing I'm going to do is grab the brow mascara, which is just, you know, a flat, pretty cool brush. I've never seen one of these because usually I've seen the brow mascaras that have um, a full kind of like mascara wand. So this one kind of intrigued me and I've been in love with it ever since. Um, if you can find... If you can't find this or any brow mascara that works for you, try using a clear mascara that works just as fine. You just need to make... You just need to use something that will set your eyebrows in place. So using a probably like a clear waterproof mascara would work just as fine. So the first thing I'm going to do is take this and brush, start at the tip of the eyebrow and wiggle. And just put all the hairs standing up. And just, you just want them, sorry it's not focusing. You just want them brushed all the way up like so when you get to the tail brush them upward but you don't want them standing up if that makes any sense once they're standing up i'm gonna let this dry and then come back and do another coat i like to do two just to make sure they're not going anywhere throughout the day the next thing i'm gonna do is go ahead and start to outline my eyebrows i'm gonna bring you guys in a little bit closer so you guys can see what I'm doing. So I'm going to just go ahead and outline it really lightly. This is in the color soft brown, so it's not going to give me any harsh lines. So I'm going to start here. Oh, you guys can't see that. And then just lightly feather my eyebrow outline. I get constantly asked about my eyebrows in my videos. I already have a video on how I do my eyebrows. Um, it's been like a, almost a year since I've uploaded it, but nothing has changed, so I'm going to link it down below just in case you're interested in how I do a more of a dramatic eyebrow. I'm going to fill it in now using light feather strokes. And then I'm going to take my spoolie because I feel like I need it. I'm going to take the spoolie and then brush through them. It has to get rid of any chunks. Now that we have the eyebrow already filled in and outlined and everything, I'm going to take a little bit more, not a little bit more, I'm going to take a little bit of concealer and then just outline the bottom to kind of clean it up a little bit. You don't want to do such a harsh line because it will be totally obvious, so I don't pick up a lot of product on my brush, so I just try to guide along whatever is on the brush to kind of help me clean up the whole eyebrow.
So that's kind of, I kind of want to clean it up a little bit more in this area. So what I'm going to do is pick up a little bit more product and just go into that area and clean it up. And there we have it, you guys. That is the end of the tutorial. The tutorial. <laughs> Hopefully you guys learned something. Um, it's pretty easy for me to do. Obviously, the only difference um, is in the color of my eyebrows. I do have jet black hair, and the eyebrows are more on the soft brown color, which I don't mind at all. I actually really like my eyebrows to be way lighter than my hair but when I do use a pomade you could obviously tell it's like a stamped on eyebrow and it just matches my hair and I don't really care for that um but the pomade that I use only goes from like blonde to soft brown the heck was that so I really have no option but to use the darkest shade but ever since I've been playing around with this technique I kind of do like it a little bit more than just that bold eyebrow especially now that it's gonna start getting hot outside I don't want so much makeup on my face kicked on even though I do prefer it some days but as of right now these eyebrows are doing it for me so like I said that is the end of the look if you guys enjoyed it please give me a thumbs up subscribe to my channel if you're not already leave me down below all your video requests don't forget that if you want to see how I normally do my eyebrows a bold eyebrow I will link it down below in the description box below so check that if you are interested as well with all the other little products I used today to recreate this if you do um, recreate this look tag me on Instagram I would love to see you guys recreate it so yeah with all that jumble bumble being said I will talk to you guys next week bye everyone